Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. This is just going to be a quick food recall because I think we need to hear this. All right. Tessa sent me this one as well. And we thank you, Tessa, for sending us these recall messages or emails, whatever, because some of this, we, some of us, if even one of you uses it, we need to know about it. Well, this one has to do with turkey. And how many of you have started using ground turkey instead of hamburger or turkey sausage instead of hamburger because it's cheaper and better for you? Well, I, I was making my dog, my other dog, turkey stew, you know, homemade stew out of ground turkey. Well, this is recent. Uh, public health alert issued on 200,000 pounds of ground turkey after salmonella outbreak. Now, here's one thing I know about poultry. You're supposed to cook it well. There's always a chance of some kind of salmonella or other bacteria infecting chickens and turkeys because they live outside and they pick their food off the ground and whatever. So we'll read it. You do what you want. Personally, I would pray over it and just cook it well. But here we go. It's under foodborne illness. All right. Here's What to Know by Carolyn L. Todd. The U.S. Department of Agriculture, the USDA, is issuing a public health alert for 211,406 pounds of ground turkey products because they may be contaminated with salmonella. The alert comes after a multi-state salmonella outbreak that officials think may be connected to the ground turkey. The USDA's Food Safety and Inspection Service, FSIS, is not issuing a full-on recall on the two tons of raw turkey because they believe that the products are no longer available for purchase in stores according to the announcement. The affected products all have a sell-by dates of January 2021 meaning retailers shouldn't need to pull them from their shelves. However, the FSIS is concerned that the potentially salmonella-tainted poultry could still be sitting in consumers' freezers. That's possible especially if it went on sale right before the sell-by date and you stocked up on it. But I'm going to tell y'all, if you trust in the Lord with all your heart and you lean not on your own understanding, in all your ways acknowledge Him. He will direct your paths. I pray over everything I eat and drink now. I included drink now. Because even bottled water can be tainted. Or at least with the plastic le leaching. I think that's the right word. Into the water. So always pray over your food and drink. Because they might miss something like this. And, and really... You want to cook meat the way you're supposed to. Uh, some people like a rare steak. Well, I say burn it on both sides real quick 
<laughs> so you still have red meat in the middle. I love burnt steak, by the way. If it's salty. Oh, yum. I haven't had one in so long. I could order it. Yes, I could. I could order a steak. I just don't want to cook it and then have to clean up. It's just so hard for me to do that in such a tiny kitchen. If I put my walker in there to sit on it, I can't open anything. And it's just... Maybe one day. All of the products were made by Pennsylvania food manufacturer Plainville Brands, LLC, and were sold nationwide under the brand names Nature's Promise, Wegmans, and Plainville Farms. The affected products included numerous lots of one and three pound packages of lean ground turkey manufactured at the Plainville Brands plant between December 18th and December 29th, 2020. They're labeled either 93% lean and 7% fat or 94% lean and 6% fat and will have use or use by freeze sell by dates of specific days in January 2021 on the front of the package the pro products will also Contain establishment numbers EST capital P-244 inside the USDA mark of inspection. If you're concerned, you may have affected products stored in your freezer. See the USDA's complete list for the specific use by freeze sell by dates. And you can click on that USDA. It's lit up in red. I'm going to quit reading here. That's enough to know. Go to the link in the description box if you want to know more. Okay, God bless each and every one of you. With that, I'm going to say bye for now. I'll talk to you later.